yellow's too much for the for the wood. It, you splinter the wood up way too much, especially when you're dealing with cedar. Cedar's a really soft wood. Green tip is more than powerful enough, as you see it. You're just you're not trying to eat away at something. You can use the yellow tip or whatever you want on concrete because it's not going to eat in. Well, the red tip might start to eat in, but. Uh, green tip is all you need. You don't ever want to use a yellow tip. I mean, you can stay further away and use a yellow tip, but if you do end up getting close enough, well, you're going to you're gonna scar your wood, and once it's done, it's done. You can't erase it. All right, today on Tools in Action, we're going over the Simpson pressure washer. We've done a lot of pressure washers. We have, haven't we? we have. We just did a couple articles. Well, we didn't do a couple articles, but we went and looked at all our previous articles. Yeah. We've done a lot of pressure washers. And, you know, it's good to do a lot because then you start to get to know what quality things you want to look for. And like we always say, quality is in the pump and in the engine. Yep. So, and like Eric said, today we're talking about the Simpson PS3228, which has got a quality Honda GX motor in it. Which is more of the pro side as opposed to, like you were saying before, the GC is more of the consumer. Right, right. The GC is going to be a lot easier, for, not easier for you to start, just simple. It's just less controls. It's just a choke and an on switch and you pull That's and it. Start. Yep. The GX motors are going to have your fuel, your throttle generally, mm -hmm. uh, your fuel on and off, and a choke switch. Yeah. So a little extra to deal with there and on off switch, of course. Uh, but today, uh, Simpson's a pretty good brand. We've done a lot of Simpson products and... With we've actually gone over to the factory or to the building. Yeah, yeah. So we've gone over there a couple of times. Yeah. They don't make they them They don't there. make them there. But, but yeah. we did see a lot of pressure washers there. We learned a lot about the company, and they do use quality components. They make their own uh, pumps, pumps, actually. And in this unit, they put a triplex pump in there. And uh, first thing we had to do with this unit was I called up Joe the handyman and said, hey, let's we'll throw this thing out to you and see what you're doing. You got any pressure washing jobs? He's like, yeah, hey, I got a deck, and I got a So what do you think of it? Uh, he liked it a lot. We're going to show you coming up here real soon. He really liked it a lot. He liked how quiet it was. And he told me it was quiet more than his GC. He had a Karcher. Uh, but he liked how low profile it was because it's going to fit in under his van shelves. He liked how light it was. It's easy to pick up. Okay. And just the general power of the unit and the responsiveness of the unit. He really uh, liked it. He couldn't say enough about it. 10 inch pneumatic tires. That's going to help you get through the deep terrain. Real easy to pull around. A 5 16th by 25 foot high pressure hose with, with the easy connectors. These yeah. connectors are nice because yeah, you're do. not screwing it on there. You just psh, pop them on there. Right. I do like to see 50 feet foot hoses on pro pro professional units, but hardly yeah. anybody puts them in there. I know. I don't know why. I don't know if the hoses can't handle it or what, why, or if just no, the cost, cost. If it's just the cost, you know. Because you know? Let's, if nobody's putting 20, 50 foot hoses in there and you're a manufacturer and you're going to throw a 50 foot hose in yours, you're going to have to yeah. raise your price a little bit and then you're out of the realm of the other guys yeah. and everybody goes by price these days. So, But if you do need to get an extra hose, we recommend uh, actually the Simpson Armor Hose. So right here, this is... I think this is a 50 foot. Yep, this is a 50 foot right here. They have a hot and a cold. We're going to show you guys the hot one. We got an upcoming heated pressure washer review that we're going to show you. Uh, this is an OEM 32 PSI, which is going to work down to negative 20 degrees, negative 4 degrees Fahrenheit, 20 degrees Celsius. So, <clears throat> I mean, obviously, if it's that cold, your water's probably freezing. But the good thing about this is it's just a flexible hose. It's their armor hose. It's like dual braided. It's a real tough hose. It's resistant to chemicals. So if you're in a harsh environment, I mean, if, if, if you're using some kind of chemical acid or really aggressive chemical, this is going to help mm -hmm. prevent eat through the hose. So cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. But all in all, Simpson is a great brand. We definitely like them. We definitely recommend them here at Tools in Action. You can't go wrong with them. And uh, that's about it. What do you think? I like it, man. It looks like a nice unit. All right, cool. And like I said, upcoming uh, in a few weeks here, we have a heated pressure washer. And that's I, gonna be cool because I've never used away. one. Yeah, yeah. That, that thing blew me away. Really? Like when I went and they were using it because it's out testing right now. We actually uh, put it to our local marina because this time of year they acid wash boats. And I, I'm gonna tell you right now, acid on a or acid algae on the bottom of a boat. You cannot get out without acid. Really? Yeah. Or oven cleaner. Oven cleaner. And you guys that have boats that keep them in the river. You, you guys know, 
it just gets on there and it just does not come off. So you, they have to use acid. Well, before they were using that in a cold pressure washer, now they've got this heated one. Uh, we're going to go out there this week and shoot some video of them using it, but it is amazing. They turned it on. I didn't even put any chemical on my wheels of my truck and they were like just gaudy, dirty. Mm -hmm. And he, he, shh, they came out like better than with soap. Wow. Yeah, from the heat. That's cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. It's the ultimate cleaning machine. So we're excited about that. Excited to get that to you. So check out toolsinaction.com. Don't forget to check out our Twitter and Facebook. We never say that anymore. Mm -mm. No, we don't. Yeah. Why? I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> Man, you're real weird today, Eric. I don't know what's <laughs> up with you. All right, toolsinaction.com. Check it out. Just right. go ahead and pull. Top one. There you go. Dude, Hondas, man, first start. This thing is quiet. Well, it's not full throttle yet. This thing is quiet still. Really? This thing is quiet. Really quiet. I couldn't hear you right now with my old one at, at, at low throttle. No way. Really? No way. Man, Joe's got a smile on his face. Yeah, it's not too often I smile when I'm working. Yeah. <laughs> when I'm starting out on these fuel, that's all right. 